gives us great pride to be able to share with you the results of an ambitious project that helps mark the centennial celebration and takes the form of a book entitled A Photographic History of the First 100 Years, The British Schools, 1908-2008. This book, edited by Victoria Cooper, Karen Shandy, and Ellen Jacoby, in their words, is not intended to be a treatise on the history of the school, but rather a brief, though not necessarily all-encompassing, chronicle of events supported by images that will hopefully rekindle or awaken many fond memories. We hope you enjoy both the words and images that follow, both of which are extracts of the text and the images of the actual book. The British Schools has had a different impact on each of us. It has meant both something personal and special to all who have been associated with it. Yet through this variety of experiences runs a constant theme that unites us all and creates an unquestionable bond among the different generations. As we look at the past, we must pay tribute to those whose vision, idealism, hard work and generosity laid the foundations on which the school was built. Over the course of these 100 years, the outer, visible part of the buildings and fields has developed as have the academic programs, the co-curricula and extracurricular activities related to arts, music, sports, community projects and so many other aspects of this thriving community. Despite all of these changes, the school spirit, which unites us all, has remained constant. It is the heart and soul of the British school. Formation for life in academics, values, moral fiber and character that leaves an imprint on those who pass through these walls. The spirit of the school, ever present, intangible and undefinable, will recreate the years spent at the school and continue to give to future generations the real strength and meaning of being a member of the British schools. The feeling of belonging, the sense of loyalty, and the integrity and firm purpose it embodies.